Engineering Mathematics 2, Anna University Question Paper, April May 2018. Question number 14A1. Evaluate the integral, integral over C, z square by z square plus 1 the whole square dz, where C is the circle mod z minus i equal to 1 by using Cauchy's integral formula. So before going to this problem, first we are going to discuss about the int formula, Cauchy's integral formula. This is a Cauchy integral formula for derivative integral over C f of z by z minus a the whole square dz equal to 2 pi i by 1 factorial 1 derivative of a. Here z minus a means this is f of a, f dash of a. On a second one, integral over c f of z by z minus a the whole cube dz equal to 2 pi i by 2 factorial into second derivative of a, f of second derivative of a. It means 3 means 2 factorial 2 derivative. 2 means 1 factorial 1 derivative. Another one, integral over c f of z by z minus a the whole power 4 into d z equal to 2 pi i by 3 factorial into f third derivative of a. It means power 4, denominator power 4 means third factorial, third derivative. 3 factorial, 3 derivative. Okay, in general, if the denominator power n plus 1, it is n factorial, n derivative. So this is Cauchy integral formula for derivative. And now in this problem, the denominator is power 2, so that 1 factorial, 1 derivative. Now the given integral is, integral over c, z square by z square plus 1 the whole power 2 into dz. Now this z square plus 1 can be written as integral over c, z square by z square plus 1 can be written as z plus i into z minus i both the term having power 2. So z plus i the whole square into z minus i the whole square into dz. Because z square plus 1 can be written as z plus i into z minus i. Okay. And now after that the given circle C is mod z minus i equal to 1. So before that first I am going to find singular point by equating the denominator equal to 0. So the denominator is z plus i the whole square into z minus i the whole square equal to 0 which implies that z plus i equal to 0 whole square 0 another one z minus i the whole square 0. So from these two from these two z plus i equal to 0 z minus i equal to 0. Whole square 0 means z plus i and z minus i both are 0 which implies that z equal to minus i and z equal to plus i. There are two singular points plus i and minus i. And now I am going to verify which points are lies inside c and outside c. Now the given circle c is mod z minus i equal to 1. So this is given circle c z minus i equal to 1. Now this is a circle with the center, center is 1 comma, uh, 1 comma 0, sorry 0 comma 1 because the general form is z minus a plus ib equal to r. Okay, so this is general form, so this is circle with the center 0 comma 1 radius 1. Okay, now we don't bother about the center, the radius is 1. So now I am going to find out which singular point lies inside C, which one lies outside C. First singular point I am taking z equal to minus i, put in circle. So put z equal to minus i. So here modulus, put z equal to minus i here, minus i, minus i equal to minus i, minus i, minus 2i. Modulus of complex number, no real part, only imaginary part. So this is root of real square plus imaginary square, there is no real part. Imagine about minus 4, minus 2, minus 2 square is 4. Root of 4 is 2, which is greater than the radius, because radius is 1, which val the value is greater than the radius. Therefore, z equal to minus i lies outside c. And next, another singular point z equal to i. So now take z equal to i. Substitute z equal to i here. So i 
minus i, which is equal to i minus i is 0, which is less than the radius. 0, the radius is 1, which is less than the radius. Therefore, z equal to i lies inside c. So, there are two singular points, z equal to i and z equal to minus i. But here, z equal to minus i lies outside c and z equal to plus i lies inside c. Now, I am going to take given equation, given integral. Integral over c, z square by z plus z, z square by z square plus 1. z square plus 1, the whole square, it is dz. Already, we converted into z square by z plus i the whole square into z minus i the whole square into dz. Now, this is lies in outside, this is lies inside. So, outside value taken in the numerator, inside value keep in the denominator. So, now which one lies inside? You see, z equal to minus i outside. z equal to minus i means take the minus i term here, z plus i. So, z plus i term is outside. So, take into numerator. So, interval over c, z square by z plus i, the whole square, outside the term take into numerator, inside the term keep in the denominator. So, you see, that is, z equal to minus i lies outside. When it is outside, z, z take minus i term here, z plus i. So, z plus i term is outside. So, z plus i term outside take into numerator, inside the term keep in the denominator. Now, by Cauchy integral formula, already we know the Cauchy integral formula for derivative is 2 pi i by 1 factorial because it, this is the denominator power is 2. If it is 2, 1 factorial, 1 derivative. So, 1 derivative of a, a is i here. So, this is equation number 1. Now, I want to find out the value of f dash of i. And then you substitute here, we will get the answer. So, where f of z is numerator, because by the Cauchy interval formula, interval over c, f of z by z minus a the whole square. So, this is the f of z. So, where f of z is, where f of z is, z square by, z square by, z plus i the whole square. So, z plus i the whole square. But I want f dash of i. But so, f dash of i means I want to differentiate this with respect to z. So, I am going to differentiate with respect to z. So, u by v method. So, v into differential of the numerator is 2z minus u into differential of denominator 2 into z plus i by denominator whole square is z plus i the whole power 4. Now, after this, I can take z plus i commonly outside, cancel the denominator. So, 2z into z plus i minus 2z square whole divided by z plus i the whole cube. So, this is f dash of z. But I want f dash of i. So, f dash of i is put z equal to i. So, 2i. So, put i here. i plus i 2i minus 2 into put i here. i square minus 1 whole divided by, put i here, i plus i 2i, 2i the whole cube. Now I am going to simplify 2 into 2, 4, i into i, i square minus 1, so this is plus 2, whole divided by 2 cube is 8, and i cube, i cube is minus i, i cube is minus i, so minus i. So now I am going to simplify, this will be minus 2, minus minus cancel, 2 means 1 by 4i. So, this is f dash of i. So, we found f dash of i, substituting in 1. So, now given integral interval over c, z square by z square plus 1 the whole square into d z equal to 2 pi i by 1 factorial into f dash of i. f dash of i is 1 by 4i. So, i, i cancel, 2 cancel, finally the answer is pi by 2. So this is the answer of the given problem.